What's up, guys? I'm Taylor. I'm Joe. And welcome back to another episode of the We Tell You Show, the show that we, where we actually answer questions based on uh, what you send us on Facebook, into our emails, uh, on YouTube, uh, comments, or uh, in person if you see us. I did an actual video with real information on it for you guys to do real things, but there keeps coming in bizarre questions. So Yes. It, it is against the law for us not to answer these questions. There are rules, so we must answer them. That's a law that was not been. You can't look that up. Don't Google it. It's not Googleable, but it's a law. We assure you to this. It's not in Google, so Google. don't uh, now, uh, do that. Earlier this week, Joe uh, did a talk on home buying. Home buying. Why you should buy a home. Why you should buy a home. You. You. Yes. Yeah, that's what the camera is. Good yes. job. Okay. Uh, so far, nothing's come up about that. Sorry, Joe. I like saying that because like, it hits, it's Joe's ego really hard. No questions have come in yet about that. <laughs> I like to see his face. I, I have real questions when I work with real clients, right? And it's really important for them. And then I put those videos out for you guys, so I can inform you that maybe that you can try these things or do these things to better your life. And there is not a not a not one. So <laughs> I'll try to answer. I like, there was a tumbleweed in the, in the yeah. Question, sorry. I'll try to answer like a real one, like how I'd work with a real life client with real experience what and we do this stuff, but. As far as that, no, nothing, nothing it's, on the. This is the equivalent of Bud Bunny calling himself because he, he wouldn't have a message. Yes, remember that episode. Um, okay, so quick, just uh, off of your, just a quick aside from your um, home buying stuff. What's better to own a if you want to buy a condo or buy a home? Oh, it's a real obvious, easy one. It's uh, well, always not. It's a question. We jerk about it. <sighs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the first, real, the, the first question. real question that came in, I was like, idiot. What the hell is wrong with it? Okay, no. Okay. So, sorry. It's easy for me because I deal with this all the time. But for everyone else out there, they actually might not know the answer. I just went over this with Taylor. I said we should probably explain it as if we've never gone over it before. And as soon as he asked it, I said, what do you mean? We've we've done this already a thousand times. And, okay. So, yeah. I'm going to keep it all yeah. real. <laughs> Keep the whole thing. Yes. Okay. So buying a home is actually a better value for long-term investment and buying a condo would be a better value for short-term investment. So if you want to just get into a condo where you want to just live for a couple of years, or if you want a place that's better than renting like an apartment, or if you want something cheap and affordable now, and then you'll be able to save money for doing something later. Um, condos come with, uh, Pros and cons. Condos come with um, you, they're easy to maintain. Uh, the outside is probably maintained by an association or the, the development. And if you have uh, a condo, the inside it's it's smaller, easier to to clean up, to do work on stuff like that. So um, if you are maybe single, starting family, or maybe you have a kid, you might want to get a condo, something something like that. But over long term, having a single family residence, like a two three standard like American home. Two three two two three two whatever like the house that you get, that is actually better because if you have more kids and you need more room and space in a backyard or uh, to play and stuff like that for the kids, family barbecues, people over, um, that is actually a better option for having events, things like that. So it depends on your situation, but overall for investment and long term stability, uh, home buying is usually the way I point uh, most people. Yes. Thank you for the question. You're welcome. You feel better yourself? Yes, I do. You feel wanted? Yes, you go. Hey, feel good? <laughs> everyone out there. That could be you. It doesn't that matter what I do in life. It does not matter if these questions <laughs> don't come in. They just, I'm, I'm broken. So just, please, keep them Talk to keep me. Them coming in if you can. Thank you. Okay. All right. He might actually have real questions because he's actually going through this stuff too himself. I do have real so he, he might have like real actual ones. So <laughs> yeah. we'll see. Oh shit! Okay, he's, he, you're my friend, right? <laughs> you care. I'm only here three do, times a week. You you care? <laughs> he, <laughs> he cares. I think he cares. All right. Next question is: What are our thoughts on this picture? I'll put the picture up in the middle here. But what are our thoughts on this picture? Yeah. Is this looks like a uh, groundhog or a looks like a small koala? Maybe a hey, baby koala. It looks fake, and that, I'm going to say, fake it, it, Photoshop. It looks like a fake picture because if that was really like a groundhog or some type of like small Koala. rodent coming after you, it'd have an angry face and be like lunging at you with his teeth. They maybe, would, they, he, it looks like maybe it's a deceiving koala where it's like, I'm happy and nice, and then it's going to get on you. And I think, no, yeah, no, koalas, yeah, koala, koala's the one that 
That's that, a koala. I'm oh. thinking. I'm thinking. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's a small bear. Maybe uh, like a poo bear. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know animals. Uh, JB always sends these <laughs> like tough ones that like it's okay. It's I, I don't know. It's a uh, it, it's very cute. I like it. I like animals. Like it's cute. But do you see? If you look closely at the picture, you see the claws out like this, and the claws, the nails are all protruding. Yeah, those are gonna hurt you real bad when the cat yeah. gets to you. That's a pretty close. Uh, if you're not a mongoose and you're not, you know, you can't sp- at speeds that can avoid a cobra, that little critter will eat your face, and then you'll be happy, and so will it, but cause you'll be dead, and it will be happy because you got a nice meal, and probably a camera too, probably robbed you. I mean, I, I would trust a koala smiling at me or whatever that is. I would probably give it money or food or whatever it wanted. But it would probably wouldn't be a good idea to touch it or not at least wash your hands before eating after handling it. Uh, I, like I mentioned, I do koalas. I believe the ones who pee on you and give you STDs. But I will let you actually know because I am uh, going tra- to you're, see you're a koala. A tra- you're a trained vet. I will see a koala. I've saw, actually I've seen them. They're at the San Diego Zoo. But I will be seeing a it's koala. California. Uh, I will. Yeah. If but if you don't have access to San Diego Zoo, you'll never see a koala. It's just not going to happen. Oh wait, they're everywhere. Okay, everywhere, everywhere has them. Okay, but um, if you uh, want to see them, they're at the zoo. They don't really do anything. They just sit in a tree all day and they they sleep and they like get mad when another koala comes in and tries to go on the tree. That's exciting have you ever news. Seen, have you ever seen koalas fighting? It's a real thing on YouTube. Is it they the really slowest? Fight. thing? Is it like sloths? Or it's they slow? just like they make this weird like nah! like no, no. <laughs> so they just attack. It's not like they just attack each other. <laughs> each other. So, yeah, I mean, I think that's what Skeletor was based off of was koala co- fighting. The son is Skeletor is koala. Those are facts. Those are real the facts. Joe fact. Yeah. Joe fact. Okay. We got two from DS, uh, both tech-based. We can have fun with this one. Who's DS? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who is this? Uh, that's a, hey, that's a, thir- that's a third person. That's a that's real a, person. The, yes, real person. That's a third person asking questions. That's cool. Like a, you know, a super popular guy. You know here. what? I'm like We're, so good right guy now because we are so popular. I think I'm gonna go all Hollywood and like ditch this show and do my own like solo thing with really bright finished teeth and <laughs> a pop star hat. Yep, and then be like, why don't we ask you questions? I yeah. always don't be here. I'm yeah. so alone. <laughs> <laughs> Crying. All right, DS ask, what is the best way to get into VR? VR mean virtual reality. Uh currently this is the age of virtual reality. Um Last year was started out with uh, video games, places in VR, uh, Microsoft uh, HoloLens, um, the uh, Oculus Rift, all good stuff. And now it's becoming more, pre- more prevalent where they have theaters who actually have uh, like they may you've seen probably like the 4D boxes where you sit in a seat and they put uh, the VR goggles on you. You can watch the watch the movie, but then they have like the, the seat move and shit. And the thing is like 30, 40 bucks a piece, so they're really expensive sometimes. It's really disgusting, but. If you want the, the immersive, you know, two-hour experience, if you can do that without throwing up, cut, I can't. Cut, cut the movie theater and then flash clip to really disgusting and they won't know what you're talking about. Nope. <laughs> Probably won't. But um, I won't be doing that. I won't be editing that video because that, that's going to that's be too much for We me. don't edit. It's it's a lot of work. So <laughs> you have to piece together an actual show it's, out of these. I sync the videos to the, the audio and I say, okay, that's good. That's fine. Upload it. Um, but no, but no. The best way to get into VR, I guess, if you can, twenty dollars or so gets you Google, um, Google, Google, uh, Bach, Google, 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 Google Cardboard. It's the or actually no, oh, actually I've seen this. You seen this? <laughs> it, oh, we got, it's just paper. <laughs> it's cardboard, but also no. We I have seen also at like Big Lots and CVS, like twenty dollars gets you a headset. A headset. You pop your uh, Android or iPhone in there. Um, if you have BlackBerry, I'm sorry, they don't make those for you. Um, but Android Black, people I, have Blackberries. I used to have Blackberry for a long time. Oh, you know that. oh that's I was, right, you did. Uh, I used to have. A I long would time. tell you all the time to get Android. You were like, Mm-mm, "Check this out, I got Blackberry." And you're the last one of friends to get Android. I swear. And I'm the one who's like not into this stuff. That's right. Now I got a poop phone. <laughs> <laughs> I got this little thing. You got a mom phone. iPhones are mom phones, my opinion, and probably what's the best opinion. Um, I have a mom phone from 2007. <laughs> like 2000. I got a really old mom phone. But that's the better way. Um, hop into your local Big Lots and uh, get your lots Big Lots stuff and then pick up a uh, virtual reality headset for $20 or so. It's not going to do much. You'll have probably something in the middle to focus the the view, and that's it. But you'll probably get uh, – it'll probably tell you to go to a store and download some apps for free. Um, 
if you're over 18, there are some adult material that you can download and view. So I've heard, and that will work. Just be careful because when you have those on, you lose it all peripheral. You can't see, you don't know what's going on. So um, you can't hear people walking the door or anything. Not from personal experience, but just FYI. Counterpoint, right. don't do it. Just stop. Don't get into virtual reality. Don't Whoa. put them on. It's going to be just like the lawnmower man. It's over. Just don't. Just, okay. Uh, JS or DS or whatever. Whatever. DS. Whatever the, DS. Okay. You know DS. Stay. I do. Stay away. Don't do it. Don't. Just stay away from virtual reality. You don't need that. You'd be focusing on buying houses. So just stop it. Stop all of it right I mean, now. That's your, isn't that your standard go-to answer? Just don't do it. Go buy houses. Yeah, I'm just like, when I look up. No, I, don't just like, I don't know what you're doing. Buy houses. All right. He also DS also asked, um, YouTube wow, TV. There's so many questions. YouTube TV. Excuse me. The future... Or another uh, trout like Google Plus. Um, now, now, do you know what YouTube TV is? I isn't you, this you YouTube don't. TV? Is it what this is? Aren't we doing so, TV right YouTube now? YouTube TV is going to be a subscription, subscription service where you can pay a couple bucks a month to YouTube and have access to NBC, ABC, a bunch of other channels. Um, on, but you have to watch it through YouTube. The only one problem with that. Those... Same channels you can get on YouTube for seventy dollars a month, seventy or seventy eight dollars a month, whatever, are also on Hulu for free. If you don't mind a minute of commercials to watch your show, and you can sign up on Hulu for free and add those shows to your queue for free, and just watch them on your TV, laptop, whatever. Not going through YouTube now. Yes, YouTube also will will have uh, HBO, I think Showtime or whatever, but on uh, separate charges. So if you want to cut the cord, that's cool. But unless you're uh, I'm a cord cutter. I borrowing do movies yeah. on, uh, and TV shows. Like some I borrowed people. lots of movies from friends across the Ukraine and the rest of the world. <laughs> yes. Thank you, guys. Um, and some people buy, you know, Netflix is a good alternative if you don't mind. If you can't catch a it's, – it's either like this. It's either – you watch the show on, on Hulu um, the next day. Some some uh, channels like CBS aren't offered through Hulu for some reason. I'm sure if you do a Google search, you can find uh, sites that will offer you to stream it. Uh, um, you know on their DVR, um, you can stream it from their website, and it's really easy to do. It's just a simple Google search. And if anything, get Netflix. Netflix is roughly kind of cheap, but they have past seasons of everything that's been out. This is the problem. I knew this was going to happen. I knew this was going to happen, guys. No no housing housing questions. I knew this was going to happen. happen. No. What was going to happen was for some crazy reason they were going to start making they have the cable bill. It costs a lot of money and you get all these channels every single month. I knew they were going to start making it so that you could buy 7 or $10 Netflix stuff or things like that. Mm -hmm. And then slowly over time all of them, all of them together, would be the cost of a regular cable bill. Yes, you didn't save us any money. You didn't do anything. You just made it more convoluted easy, and more complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Where's our next show? I mean, <laughs> come out and get that camera. Yes, but eventually, yeah. If you do want to have, say, if you want to say, um, oh, shit. Okay, so say <laughs> if you Netflix right now is like twenty bucks, and you get like ten bucks or twelve bucks for no commercials for Hulu. Roughly 32, 35 bucks uh, with taxes and so forth. 35 bucks. 35 dollars is the same is also what you pay for internet and what you would pay possibly. Um, you probably get a really slow internet connection and a decent basic cable package that includes those channels, NBC, ABC, Fox, what have you, in HD along with other channels for about 50 bucks. Now, yeah. if you need your HBO shows, then... Again, you can borrow them as you fit. If you can ask somebody, not us here on the show, but personally, we can help you out with that. Counterpoint. Digital antenna, regular channels, and uh, Netflix, you're good. That's all you need. You don't need anything else. You don't even fall into these other gimmicks of Google TV this and Amazon that. Don't do it. Don't buy it. It's all just a marketing scam anyway. So YouTube TV, um, it just... (laughs) So he tries to concentrate on this subject. (laughs) I'm sorry. Uh, so back to the last thing. Uh, YouTube TV is essentially the same thing as Hulu. And, it's the same thing as Hulu. That's all it is. It's a competitor, except you're on YouTube. What happens? And then don't do it. But don't. but the thing is, they don't tell you. 
is that with Hulu, you pay 12 bucks and you get no commercials. But with YouTube TV, your monthly bill for YouTube TV includes commercials. There's no way around it. You always have commercials. I, so, re- I remember like my mom was watching uh, Hulu and she was like, it's the same damn commercial every time. It's just the same one. I've already seen the commercial. Just like about to <laughs> scream at the TV every time. The same one. <laughs> she, she was so pissed. They didn't give her the option. I'm of- like, in your day, in your day, you'd have to catch this show like at two o'clock, whatever the afternoon, every day, catch your soaps and you're I mad. Watch my stories. Yeah, and you're mad that there's the same commercial every like ten minutes. <laughs> but that's my thoughts on YouTube TV. YouTube TV, <clears throat> I wouldn't do it. Um, stick to YouTube channels like ours. Watch videos like ours and only ours. Joe. Yeah, of course. What else do you watch on the YouTube? No one watches anything else. Mm-mm. Yeah, I think we watch this show, right? I like are how you, you talk forever you there? and you don't you don't drink it anymore. I, I I talk for five minutes and my, and my nose my, is just jacked right now. So my, my, my mouth is is so dry. Don't take that out of context. That really sounds bad. Um, there's also another question. We're not here. strong beginners or enders, but you know what? In the middle, we're like really good at this stuff. Like right in that middle, just like you know, I'm not sell- telling you to skip over it. I'm saying that it's a surprise and it comes at you. No, somebody did also ask, um, how much would have would, would Chuck Chuck would Chuck would Chuck would? <sighs> Guys, and I, then I believe she deleted her uh, her question. <laughs> that is a critical financial question. <laughs> how much would it would Chuck Chuck? So who was that? Who did that, that was MC. MC. I don't know until, until you know, MC. Until we know oh, yeah. people say if he, when you say our questions, say us know you want your names read, and we'll give your you'll read your names. Um, how much would a would Chuck Chuck? Uh, here's the thing. That's racist. Save your money and buy a house. <laughs> Save it. That's what my answer to that question is. You know, if a woodchuck, uh, if you if the woodchucks were savings, then he would have enough wood to buy a home by now. So that's the yes. answer to that question. All the chucks in the world. Yes. They can have all the chucks and all the woods and all the homes and all the savings and all the credits and all the shows and all the time to watch YouTube shows like ours. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, the Joe tells you, the we tell you, and let me rant show. I think that's. I think Joe's saying that the show is ending. Okay. On that note, thank you for watching. Again, we'll be here next Friday. I'll don't forget to watch. Like I mentioned, the Joe tells you on Monday. The Let Me Rant on Wednesday, and uh, every here every Friday here we, we have to answer the questions. You. It's the law. It is the law. So don't we don't we don't agree, but I mean, it's just what do you I do? Agree. Do you want to get arrested for it? I'll I mean, we got to you. answer the questions. <laughs> All right, that's it. Thank you. See you later.